In this video, we have our first look at the Episode 6 Act 2 Battle Pass. Let's not waste any more time and hop right into it. To start off the video, let's go over the Battle Pass facts as usual. Just like all other previous Battle Passes, this one will have free and paid content. This one will cost 1000 Valorant points. The new content in this Battle Pass looks awesome, and you will be able to get your hands on it and start your new act grind for unlocking the rewards on March 7th when the new act goes live. Now, let's get further into the content of this pass starting off with the weapon skins. As you would all expect, most people end up spending money on a battle pass to get access to exclusive battle pass gun skins and for good reason. So what is Riot gifting us for Act 2? Now that we know the three skin lines are Top Attack, Signature, and Tilda, let's see what these new weapon skins are about. First, let's start off with Tilda, as this will be the skin line with variants this time around. In this collection, the weapons that will be featured will be the Bulldog, Judge, Melee, Op, and the Shorty. The standard color for this skin line looks to be gold and gray, and the other variants included are red, purple, and green blue. This definitely looks like the coolest looking skin set out of the bunch, and I'm definitely looking forward to getting the AWP and Dagger Knife and upgrading the variants with the Radiantite I'm going to get from the pass. The next skin line is Top Attack, and the weapons featured in this collection will be the Bucky, Ghost, Odin, and the Phantom. This bundle has a purplish colorway and appears to have a future tech theme going on similar to the film Tron Legacy, one of my favorite films growing up as a kid. It's a great looking skin set nonetheless. I look forward to unlocking the Phantom and Odin out of this bunch. The final skin line of this pass is Signature, and the weapons being featured in this bundle are the Guardian, Marshal, Sheriff, and Stinger. This skin line looks really cool because it looks quite similar to the graffiti we saw in the Gecko Agent Reveal cinematic that came out a couple days ago. It's bright and the colors pop off the screen for sure. The graffiti designs look sick on the guns as well. I'm going to look forward to rocking these skins while playing Gecko real soon. Moving on to the player cards, let's see if Riot was cooking with the cards this time around. Right off the bat, Riot has some great memes along with some really well made artwork for the player cards in this battle pass. Some of the meme and funny player cards include the Brunch at Crown card, the Commander Bruno Doge card, and the Setting Records card along with its gold variant. I really love the Commander Bruno card, because anything that has to do with Dogecoin memes is guaranteed to release serotonin into my body. But what's even more impressive is just some of the cool themes and well-made artwork of the other cards. The Boot Camp and Boot Camp Stealth card, the Gentle Breeze card, the Pixel Moments card, the Streetwear card, and the Signature card are just some top-tier graphic design work by the art team at Riot Games. I really like that Pixel Moments card, I'm definitely rocking that thing the second I unlock it in the pass. Wrapping up this video, let's get to the sprays and gun buddies. Right off the bat with the sprays, some of my favorites are the Buy Off Jet Spray, the What Surprised Yoru Spray, the Wide Swing Ray Spray, the Wanted Tacta Bear Spray, and the Omen Cat Dance Spray. Not only are these sprays cute little anime versions of the agents, they're also funny as heck if you look at the artwork in a humorous context. They definitely made me laugh a bit when I first saw them. And for the gun buddies, some of my favorite looking gun buddies at a first glance are the Crispy Fries Gun Buddy, the Bounce House Gun Buddy, the Cat Eye Gun Buddy, the Lucky Star Gun Buddy, and even the Egg in a Basket Gun Buddy, which has an Easter theme going on for it. These are all great looking gun buddies, and I can't wait to rock them on my guns when I unlock them. Well everyone, that's all we have for this news update on the Episode 6 Act 2 Battle Pass. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more like this, make sure to drop us a like and subscribe to keep up to date with the latest news, updates, and guides. And good luck on that grind in the new Act 2.